What's up guys and gals and welcome back to Mother Russia Bleeds. My name is Splattercat, happy to have you here today as we hang out for a little while and continue to pugilize, pummel, and otherwise just pulverize the enemies that step before us. Today we're playing some Ivan and we're on the next level, which is the squat. So Ivan, it looks like he's got a pretty long reach. He's got some bulging veins and biceps and all that kind of stuff. He's already got an eye out. So, you know, if you wanted to keep an eye out, play Ivan, I guess. He's got a jump kick that looks like it's got a decent range. Okay. If you're wondering why I always kick so early in my jump like that, it's because classically in fighting games, you can actually catch enemies on the way up if you kick like the second you come up off the ground. Hey, man. Shit, it's been ages. You smear a smoke for an old pal? Dude, instead of begging, tell me what went down here. Whole place is wrecked. Huh? Oh, yeah, that. Man, that's ancient history. I guess you went on an extended vacation or whatever. <laughs> yeah, it was that gang of skinhead chicks. A whole bunch of them came and took over the area. Then they started passing out Necro. But haven't you tried to drive out the dealers, you know? Take back your camp? Ah, sure, Vlad's trying. He started a revolution or some crap. He's been recruiting people for weeks now. Should be able to find him at the train station. I had to tell him to fuck off. That guy gives me a nasty headache. Alright, I'm gonna go look for him. Thanks, bro. Oh shit, it's meltdown time. Oh man, we vomited all over our knees. Ah oh, shit, not these images again. This thing is getting bigger. Side effects of the necro, I'm guessing. Or maybe those are just the knee pads that... Oh, they got attack dogs. You guys know how my relationship is with attack dogs. It has not been so wonderful. They appear to be kind of weak to jump kicks, so I'm going to be running that down from now on. And if you can run them down, I would strongly suggest giving the dogs the ground and pound. Oh, I can beat people with a telephone wire. Yeah, buddy. Ring, ring. Moshi, moshi, Splattercat. Damn it. He was like Doggy Desu. I was like Splattercat Desu, but he was like, nope. It's Doggy Desu. Hey, that guy apparently has a connection with the dude or the dog I just beat down. Ooh, we gave him the haymaker right there in the tummy gut. Okay. I'm going to get the dog if I can. There we go. Dog's down. Go ahead and throw him up and out of the way. He's already convulsing, so why even worry about it? Man, I got to get somebody with that gut shot right there. I have to. Oh, you can just run up on the dogs and pound them out. Okay. Unfortunately, the jump kicks don't really seem to work on the dogs very well. The collision seems to be somewhat ignorant of the fact in my placement on the map here. Oop. But theirs works perfectly fine, so that's going to be something we have to adjust for. The dogs are not acceptable, though. They got to go with a quickness. The health on those things is just absurd. And apparently they are necro-infected as well. I had no idea that the dogs have been injected with necro, so that explains why they're so vicious and coming after us. It's not just because we look like a hot piece right now. Bastards. I remember him. He shouldn't take shit from anybody. Apparently they used him as an example. Ew. Alright, ladies, shut your traps and listen up. The Bratva wishes to congratulate you on a job well done in junk. You have the boss's permission to use the gym. We even planned a little shindig for you. You'll see we haven't been jerking you around, but beware, some dickhead is expected to show up soon. We want him alive, you hear? You run into him, you bring him straight to us. Alright? At ease. Hey, buddy. You're the fucker squatting in our camp, huh? Eh, speak of the devil. I must be one of those fortune tellers or something. So you think your crappy little goons can stop me? You and your lapdogs are going to answer all my questions, and more importantly, you're going to go peddle that shit someplace else. Ooh, you hear that? We got ourselves a gypsy comedian. Enough with the jokes. I'm going to teach you some respect. Are you, though? Because you look like you kind of get whooped on right now. Oh, you want to come in with the aerial, huh? You ain't that talented. I hate to tell you, but your jump kicks are weak. See, that guy knows how to throw a punch right there because he got them spaghetti arms. Knows how to throw that shit out there. Can I do like a... Oh, I could do like a charging hit too. All right, we're going to go in like so. See how... Oh, he came over the top. Okay. All right. That's how you want to play this. That's how it can go all day long. Believe me when I say I'm ready for this shenanigans. Knock a couple of you guys down. Work his jaw a little bit. Jump out of the way right there. Oh, he jumped straight into it. Man, we gotta watch these little skinny dudes. These little skinny dudes ain't playing. Neither are apparently the rest of them. 
There it is. No, I wanted to punch the guy standing up, not the guy that was on the ground. That's fine, whatever. Go ahead and give myself a little injection of love potion here. Nope, not gonna play that game right now either. Man, the distance on that guy's vertical. There we go. Give me some of that good shit. Just a little bit more. Ah, he got me over the top. I should have seen that one coming. We'll go under the bottom right there, though, and straight into that guy's fist. Yay, because I'm talented at getting punched, apparently. Yeah, my kick overrides his kick, though. His kick don't want none. Come on, fill her up. All the way. That's what I like to see. What is this over here? What is this going to do for me? Ooh, there's all kinds of goodies in there. I'm going to go with... What is that thing on the ground right there? I don't even know what that is. Oh, it's a bottle. Okay, I got you. Well, maybe I'll go with the golf club first. Let's stick with the golf club. I think people need to... Oh, that guy. Yikes. Apparently, we can crush people's heads, too. What's happening over here? He said something, but I wasn't sure what he said. Probably some big mamma jamma. Hey, Jib's way behind the line like everybody else. We're not open yet. Quit shrieking and open the fucking gate. Ooh, you're the bossy type, huh? Listen, I ain't got time for your shit. Get back behind the line and wait for your fix with the rest of the junkies. All right, then. Suppose I'll just have to make you leave. So we can bust into this car over here. I don't think I'm going over the top. We got our Street Fighter reference in. You goddamn... I'm going to rip your head off and shit down your throat. Wasn't that a Duke Nukem line? I'm pretty sure that is. Oh, man. I was trying to say four, but they punched too fast. There it is. You get out of here. I ain't got time for your shit. Give me that club. Somebody's getting whooped on right now. Oh, that one's got a gun, though. That's a concern. Got him with the backhand. Oh, wow. Shot his own friend's head off. So I don't need you guys near the gun at all. If you guys could stay away from that good shit, I'd appreciate it. Ah, he got me. Balls. And stopped convulsing right when I was trying to get in on it, too. Somebody have the gun? Somebody's got to have the gun, I was going to say. Oh, that wasn't what I wanted. No! I want the gun. Give me the gun. Oh, was that the last bullet? It appears as though we may have been lit into by our final bullet. Ooh, we got the big hit right there. Okay. So apparently if we hold down the button, we get that good shit lined up. Be teaching dudes lessons with a quickness. Ugh. I like that. That's gotta, I gotta grunt when I play games like this, like when you land the big hits. That's the only way. Oh, you can move while charged up, too. Well, I wasn't looking forward to getting blapped in the head with any type of weapon. That kick overrides, like, everything. And it lights off hella quick. Come on, y'all ain't want none. That's right, get up out of here. Oh, you got a gun. Nope. Get out of here. Don't pull a weapon if you ain't want to play. All right, get myself healed up a tiny bit. Oh, there's more inside there? Yeah, give me some more. No complaints from me. Let's get paid up. Having some trouble? Is the game not up to your speed? Go ahead and change the... No, that's like playing... See, I don't accept that as a solution. I hate when games say that. They're like, oh, are you too bad at the game? Turn down the difficulty. No. How about I bring myself up to the next level? How about we charge up like Goku and we come back with the spirit bomb and knock this game out of the park? Ooh, gnarly. Hey, how'd you get in here? Fucking hell. I remember this place used to be peaceful. Hey, you're, uh, you're pretty cute. Do you, uh, want to shoot up some necro nearby? Just the two of us? I don't know what's more disgusting about you, the sores or the piss smell. Wait, wh what did you just say to me? Let's put it this way. You run along back to the other necro heads or I'll kick the few teeth you have left. Wait, what did you just say? You're not kind of hard of hearing, aren't you? Oh, she got a knife, though. 
I don't know if I'm playing that knife business right now. So, oh, that's a syringe. Never mind. That's a little terrifying. Give me that barrel. I'm going to start busting some heads with this thing. There we go. Back them all up. Yep, ain't no time for slam dancing around here. All this hardcore kid stuff. We shut that down real quick. Oh, and look at that. You guys got more weapons for me? Here, catch. Oh, I can't pick up the stick. Making some serious mistakes right now. Oh. Try and get somebody with a wind up here. Oh, that was terrible. That was the worst. Ooh, those syringes go hella far. It's amazing they get them tip in the first time, too. Damn. They keep picking them back up. Ah, Jesus. Get out of here, bitch. Yep, somebody's getting worked on right now. Oh, she pulls out more. Oh, see, I thought that was working differently than it actually did. I'm not sure how I caught that one. That one seemed a little weird. Jesus. This game is brutal. Although, I think it's because the hitboxes for the enemies are a lot more generous than the hitboxes you get with some of your characters. Like, it seems like you catch stuff from weird angles every now and again. But then you try to do the same thing from your angle and it doesn't work. Can't pick up the syringes, neither. Alright, so they're down. I don't even know if I need to actually fight all those guys up there. That might have been my last problem as I, I lit up too many people. So you can't half charge that shit either. Like you gotta go in when you go in. You come here. Cause I'm trying to play that mess. That syringe shit hurts. Oh, I can't pick them up while they're on the ground either. I was trying something new. I was trying to see if I can maybe get them while they're on the ground. All right, catch you guys like that. Ah. See, that attack's kind of weird. Like, sometimes it seems to work okay. And then other times, it's like, it misses by narrow margins. Get that convulsion done and over with. Cool. Give me a barrel. So maybe that's how I messed up. I wasn't supposed to fight with it. Oh, they got me from behind. Damn. Oh, this dude's got cover and everything. Throw Molotovs in here and everything. Ah. Ah. Damn, so this game's hella hard. This game is not messing around. I'm thinking we do this like this. That's still not even helping. There we go. Get that gun out of his hand. Her hand. It's hand. Whatever. And then we go in. Man, he still got me. Goddamn dogs. Get out of here. Oh. Yep, I'm not playing this mess. You all gotta go. I got guns, and I ain't trying to play around with fist fighting everybody. Y'all just gotta get ready to die like this. I think the secret might be getting guns away from people. Might be my only hope. What are you even try and line up on me? What are you trying to do right now? Don't you see this AK in my hand? Don't you see the unholy reckoning that is falling down upon you? 
Oh, he leaves the gun behind. Isn't that the action hero thing to do? Like, ah, you know, I've already murdered like 400 people today. I'll just leave the gun behind. Obviously, I'm not going to need that even though all my enemies have them. I'll take this. And we've got rats on this level. So let's watch out for those as we saw in previous episodes. I am apparently not very good at this. As we saw in previous episodes, the rats will jump on you if you're not careful. Perfecto. Stay down. How hard is it to find a baseball bat in Russia? Is there difficulty associated with that task? I don't really think of Russia as being like a big baseball playing country. Perfect. Ooh, couldn't get any better. Don't mind if I do. Ah, he's all out. Sucked all of his juices dry. I should charge for this kind of service. Is that one going to twitch, though? Oh, somebody left some flip-flops right there. Anybody want some flip-flops? This is a deep-ass pool. God damn. We got junkies in here with, like, paratrooper skills and shit. You see that shit? They just dropped in like they came from a helicopter. My only goal for right now is to get you the hell out of my way. Ah! I am just going to ground and pound the shit out of you. There it is. Give me a bit more. We're almost at the top. Would you look at that? A little rat wandered into my pool. Let me guess. You're the leader of this band of merry creeps. Hey, it's a talking rat. Sorry, I'm all out of cheese. Don't test me. I got a few questions and you're going to answer them. Ha! <laughs> Sweetie, you could take your questions and shove them. This camp was raided a few months back. Trucks full of riot police that showed up out of nowhere. Dragged everybody off. You know anything about that? Nope, I don't. But now I see why our arrival here went so smoothly. Heh. <laughs> Quit screwing with me. We woke up in some dirty-ass lab with crates of necro all over. So who's supplying you, huh? Where's this crap coming from? God, you're a pain in my ass. All right, I'll tell you one thing. The middleman who gets me the necro is an old guy. Goes by the name of Mikhail. Wait, what? Mikhail? Ah, you hear that sweet sound? It's a little surprise I had planned for you. It took forever to get here, but it's well worth the wait. It's time to shut you up for good, little rat. Oh, shitballs. Yeah, I'm not feeling this. So it appears as though dash attacks seem to do pretty well. Although, once again, their kicks seem to override everything. Oh, God. I'm thinking the best way to handle this is just like that. Ow. No, 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 no. I don't go this way. You go that way. I don't think she actually has a health bar. I think our goal is just to put her into the blender as best as possible that one's gone so let's keep working ah she keeps getting me with the back hit though I don't know if I can grab her or if that's even like possible it seems like you gotta distance that out just right well oh no There it is. Oh, nope. Now she's mad. Shit, that wasn't the right move. All right, give me an outside weapon. Oh, that's a good one right there. Yeah. That gave her a good ass knockback. Get inside that blender. Perfect, because we ain't making it. Ha! <laughs> How'd you like that ride, fatty? Anyways, hopefully Vlad is still sitting at the train station. Nice. We survived. Mother Russia no longer bleeds. So now what I want to do... Oh, we made it to the the underground concert. So we need to do another... We need to do another arena. We got to get, like, a legit... A legit drug. We got to try something new. If we don't, 
It just feels like a waste of time. So let's see if maybe we can bang out one of these arenas. The dogs are what got us last time. The dogs got us hard. We'll call this, oh, I don't know, arena. Basically, at the end of each episode, I'm going to try and do like an arena thing. Apparently, I did poorly. I'm not even like the top thousand. That's punk mode right there. Well, let's try it again. We got this. I believe. Do you believe? Because you got to believe in order for this to work. Let's take Boris with us because he's our dude. We got the Kremlin Colonel. Oh, we can bring bots with us? Well, shit. Why didn't I bring some bots then? That'd probably make this easier. That's my impression of the music in this game. I like how they brought festive birthday balloons. Just to make... What does Boris do as his special attack? Oh, he's just got like a big ass haymaker that he's going to throw out there. Alright. Throw that haymaker, son. Get him out of here. We got time for these hobos. These punk bastards. These guys aren't on our level. These guys are scrub style. Ow. They're apparently offended by my designation of scrub style. Oh, I can throw them up in the air. Okay. If I throw them up in the air, can I do anything with that? It seems like I should be able to do something with that. Like, doesn't it seem like that would lead into something else? I feel like it should lead into something else. I'm going to use my drugs right now. Because I got the feeling... That down the line, we're probably going to get to utilize... A suck body over here. There we go. Suck body accomplished. These guys don't jump or anything like that, so technically I should be able to just take them out with the big hits, no problem. Although we do got the little green guy right there. Something tells me I should probably start dodging better. Also, my reach is encumbered at the moment. Line you guys up for a shot here. Good. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. I meant to do that. Suck him dry, buddy. That's all that we got out of there. There's another one biting the dust. Dodge out of the way of that shit, because we don't play that game. That was a pretty good combo right there. I feel solid about that one. I feel no remorse. This guy's down. I need to get some juice out of him. Then we'll charge back this way. Ah! I overextended. See, I got I got overexcited and I overextended. Our attacks are really good at ripping pants. I feel like there's a solid setup for a SpongeBob SquarePants episode right about now. Stay healed. There we go. All good to go. Okay, so we got our first line of dogs in here. The dogs are problematic because they mean I can't really dedicate to any one fight. I mean, I can knock them down for a minute. Ooh, I could jump over them too. See, the dogs kind of override everything. That's the thing with the dogs is that they go around everything. There's not much you can do about it. And so many of the enemies have grabs and knockdowns that it's like... There it is. That's what I like to see. I would not like to deal with any more dogs if I can help it. But if I can knock down a couple more of you guys with a nice little burst right here, I would not hate my situation. I tried to dodge right there, but I missed the I missed the key. Jesus. So our first order of business here is that we got to round them up all to one side. If we don't do that, we've already lost. Secondly, crowd control works well like so. Alright, we're refilled up. Catch him with a little... I really am interested in what I can do with that. That's what I really want to know is what can I do with the upchuck? Alright, where your dogs at? Where your dogs at? I know they're here. It might be wise just to start spamming that dodge key. Ah! Get off me. Okay. 
God damn. What do you even do about the dogs? The dogs are like a major hassle. And that was a swing and a miss. Embarrassingly enough. Oh my god. There are a lot of grabs in this game. There are a lot of grabs and a lot of stun locks. There. Get the hell out of my face. I don't care how many of you I kill. Get a couple in on the dog right there. I do think we need to isolate the dogs first. There we go. Dogs out of the way. So now that the dog's done... See how many of you guys I can get up and out of my hair. Ain't really got time to suck any juice off anybody, but I'm still gonna try. Just get a little bit out of there. There it is. That's what I'm looking for. Give me that good stuff. Where's your dog at? Where's your dog at? I know he's in here. Oh, wow, he didn't even do the animation that time. He just jumped on me. They should probably fix that. He should probably have to do the animation. No, the dog. Get the dog. Don't punch those guys. You did the exact opposite of what I wanted you to do. Yeah, the dogs are like little heat-seeking missiles. Something tells me there's slight adjustments that need to be made there. There we go. Got him out of the way. Oh, apparently you can slam downwards as well. I didn't even know that, so I learned a new thing today. Let's get healed up. Miss a big shot because I'm a noob like that. Okay, who we got still standing? Very few people. I mean, that's pretty good crowd control right there. If you're trying to keep them up and off of you, they tend to line up along the same, like... I feel like that's probably the smartest plan that I can enact right there. Just stay on top of them with the big hits. Just heater them out real fast. That's wave six down. Hopefully we'll do better this time. Come on. Bring them in. Line them up one at a time. We're going to knock them down as they come in. That one's a little green over there. I think he might have some kind of liver problem or something. I don't know. What makes you green? Like, what thing could go wrong with your physical... No! A dog biting could go wrong with your physical health, and I suppose that would make you green. Eventually, from the gangrene. That's why they call it gangrene, is because you turn green. Not a lot of people know that. Not a lot... Man, I really wish I could avoid getting bit by these dogs. These dogs are like nasty customers, and once you get dog piled on, the corner trapping is so real in this game. The corner trapping is so real. The second they get their hooks in, you just know that you're hosed from then on in. I've seen entire health bars disappear. <laughs> Beat this dog down. Come on. Oh, no! It's okay. I kick somebody like that, too, if they're messing with my dog. My dog's legit, though. My dog would never let somebody pound on him like that. He'd be like, arf, 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 arf. He'd be getting all up inside their shit. He goes deep. Nobody messes with Winston, a.k.a. Gator Grip, a.k.a. Vanilla Killer, a.k.a. White Lightning, a.k.a. Moonshine. My dog's a killer. He's got lots of nicknames, too. He's... He's holding it down as far as nicknames go. He's got it covered. I really need to get this dog se separated from my ass. Get off me. Yay! The dog is dead. The dog is dead. I punched him in his doggy head. All right, so we've eliminated the dog. That kind of fixes, like, a number of our issues. Now I'm just going to, like, I'm going to heavy blow these dudes. I am so glad chat told me that there was a heavy blow. If I didn't know that there was a heavy blow, my life would be just, like, ruined right now. Heavy blow is so good. Unfortunately, I still haven't learned the hitboxes for the game. Sometimes things don't connect that I really feel like should connect. But I think that might be because I'm super used to Streets of Rage 2. Like, I play a lot of Streets of Rage 2. I don't think you guys realize I still play Streets of Rage 2 all the time. I've played Streets of Rage 2 and beaten it at least like a couple times a month since I was like six years old. 
Like, I am criminally obsessed with Streets of Rage 2. It's like one of the greatest side-scrolling beat-em-ups of all time. In fact, I would vote for it as the greatest side-scrolling beat-em-up of all time. You know, it, it's just that good. Axel and Blaze are obviously the two best. Max is okay. And then Skate is cool if you can get used to Skate. The thing is with Skate, you can't rely on his ability to, like, muscle people out or anything like that. Because he's so small. He does have that over-the-head flip thing, though, where he uses his momentum. There's a guy with a knife. He uses his momentum to throw the... I, I don't know. It's one of my favorite games of all time. It's definitely top 10. Never played Streets of Rage 3 because I heard it was garbage. Like, I heard they messed up the speed of the game or something like that. But I'll probably get it someday and play around with it. Man, we're on wave 9 already? This is like a good deal for us. I need to knock some fools out here. Or no, wave 8. I'm sorry. I'm bad at seeing numbers. I know my numbers. Sorry, I'm trying to focus on the game, but I'm getting my ass whooped right now. That dude just beat the berserk out of me. You know how bad that is when somebody beats the berserk out of you? We're in a really strong position, though, to make a good run on this survival mode. I do like the survival mode. It's cool. I would also love to see a procedural mode where it just gives you a background set and you just walk through, like, various scenery that's just stitched together and then you get random enemies at each accord that match the background and then they do random stuff and they'll have different weapons and things like that and every, like, eight maps you go past, you get, like, a random boss from inside the game or something. And then they could recolor them with guys that you can't get inside the game. So you get, like, recolored versions of the bosses that are stronger and stuff like that. You know, I'll play the hell out of Oh, we got another dog. Goody. You know, I just don't know what to do with myself with these dogs. They got me pinned something fierce right now, though. Oh, my God. I was trying to get up. I was trying so hard to get up. That's all I wanted to do was to be up. And see, now my health's going to be all janked out. It's just a mess of me getting pounded on. It's getting monkey punched into oblivion. <laughs> These heat-seeking doggies. Get off me! And it's like I want to charge up like a mega hit and just like go in on these dogs. But... God, they can take so much damage too. Gotta beat on those things forever to get them down. Hopefully the dog... There we go. Nope, he got me. Shit. Well, the last two executions went pretty well. Is he down? He made whimpery noises. No, he's not down. Yeah, this is not looking so great for me right now. I'm spending an inordinate amount of time just kiting around trying to deal with the dog. I don't think we're going to be able to get in right there. Uh... I just need, like, a little gap to get the dog. That's all that I need. There we go. The dog is down. We should be all right now. I bet we're all right now. If we're not all right now, I would be really, really surprised. Sonic Punch! I'm calling that the Sonic Shoulder. I don't know. I really like that punch. Just one time I'd like to punch somebody like that when they give me shit in traffic. Just one time. Just sitting there, dead stand still on the 80. Just being like, man, I really wish I didn't have to go into the city today. And then that one person just locks eyes, and they're just like, you a bitch. And you're like, squee. You put the window down, you're like, all right, what you say? And they're like, you a bitch. And then you'd be like, oh, hell no. And you're like, pop, pop. Get out of the car, you just wind one of those suckers up, just like, da 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 Right in front of the toll booth. And then everybody would be hanging out the cars at their window, just like, oh! Because that's how it happens out here. There's a real, real, out here, there's a real, real short supply of, like, education and general empathy for your fellow man. So when somebody gets yoked, just, like, choked out in public, it's like, well, take the, I can't afford to go to the movies. So we take the entertainment we can get. <laughs> we lived! We made it to round ten! No, there's so many more guys with knives! I need to get them bunched up, and then I'll start, like, mega-punching them in just a minute. I wonder if there's going to be dogs. Oh, he got me. I thought I was going to sneak through. That was pretty sneaky, though, right, sis? I thought so. God, there's so many of them. There we go. Knock some helmets off these dudes. I should pick up the helmets and hit them with them. Unfortunately, there's so many dead bodies around that it's like, how do you even keep track anymore? Let's whoop these dudes. Oh, the guy in the back got me. My dash just wasn't long enough. I feel like my combo counter just went up when he was whooping on my ass. See, that's the problem. The game's cheating. My combo counter is actually on the other team's side, and it's sabotaging me. It's making me... Oh, he doesn't get knocked back by the people getting knocked back? No! Oh, he slapped me out of the air. He said, nope. 
She said, no, no, no. Not in my house. Damn it. This is not looking good. My gentleman is holding his face. Oh, he came from off screen. He got me, though. Uh, I don't know what to do. Ooh, that almost went badly. No! Well, that's it. I need a nap. I'll see y'all next time. Bye, everybody.